Here's another one of those crazy mathematical tricks. Uh, let's start off with uh, mixing up the deck a little bit because it makes it more magical if we mix up the deck. Here, some here, and some here, some here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a prediction. So my prediction would be... Uh, I'm not getting many vibes, but we'll use that as my prediction. Then what I'm going to do, we'll roll some dice. Alexa, roll a pair of imaginary dice and give me the total. Snake Eyes plus one. Got a one and a two for a total of three. Those imaginary Alexa, stop. So let's count out one, two, three cards. And we'll just put them under here for now. And now I'm going to take 12, 12, and 12. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, now, whatever number Alexa rolled, we're going to take that out of each pile, and that will be the chosen card. So, we did choose, Alexa chose, 1, 2, 3. So, we'll go to the first pile, 1, 2, and 3. The next pile, 1, 2, two and three. The next pile, one, two, and three. And let's take a look at my prediction. My prediction is an ace of spades. Let's take a look at the first card. It's an ace of diamonds. The next card, an ace of hearts. The next card is an ace of clubs. And then we've got these piles here. So what if I take this ace here and I will put it down right over here and then we turn over the first card on the bottom it's a ten of spades then I've got a jack of spades then the next pile I've got on the bottom a queen of spades and the last pile on the bottom I've got a king of spades giving me a royal flush I hope you enjoyed that